Hello everyone, my name is Python and welcome back to another episode of my Minecraft survival series. We are starting off with this epic dancing parrot man. In the last episode at the end, of course, we grabbed this little guy and we discovered this awesome Easter egg, which is freaking sweet. <laughs> Uh, oh, I do love it. But anyways, guys, thank you so much for the support you showed in the last episode. And of course, if you are still hyped for the series and you want to continue showing your love, be sure to drop a like rating below the video, my friends. Thank you in advance if you do decide to do that. But anyways, guys, today's fan comes from a user by the name of Low Gamer, And what they have done is they have sketched myself and a little wolf pet running beside me in a little sort of Minecraft world. And it is amazing. It is amazing, amazing fan art. Thank you so much. I love the drawing style. I love the color of it. It's just really, really nice. Thank you very much, Low Gamer. Now, guys, fan art email is on screen, and of course, you can send it in through Twitter if you so wish for those of you artists out there. And yeah, you'll have a chance of yours being used and your name shouted out. Let's go down and off now. <laughs> and uh, yeah, in today's episode, my friends, we are going to be going ahead and, uh, and doing a, a little a little thing. We've got a bunch of materials here, and we're actually going to go and start off by doing something I don't normally start off by doing, which is jumping into the comment question of the video, which comes from Matt. Malachi James, are you going to change all the villagers' houses to make them look better? Yes, and that is exactly what I am wanting to do in today's episode. I've got myself a bunch of materials, and I think the first thing I want to do is replace all of the roofs, because as you guys know, the roofs on villager houses are rather quite boring. As you can see, they're very flat. I mean, yeah, they just are. They're just very, very flat. So what I thought we'd do is I thought we'd go ahead and spruce things up a bit. We've got some stone bricks. Uh, hmm. I kind of want to get some more stone bricks, actually. Uh, my advancements are all kinds of messed up. Like, for some reason, I, I just don't get it. They keep resetting or whatever. It's just really, really strange. But we're going to start off with this roof here because I already kind of have a solution for this thing. A very basic solution, but one which I think you guys will kind of like. And we're actually going to start off by putting that back. And what we are going to do is we're going to add another layer of stairs on the outside, okay? So we're going to go ahead and do this, which is going to give the roof not only a nice accent in terms of the materials used, but it's also going to give the roof a little bit of depth, which is, you know, always good to see. So let's go ahead and continue on. What we've got to do now is get rid of this lower level right here, replace this all with stone bricks as well. Uh, oh, there's a leaf there. <laughs> but uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do this. That's in the wrong place. Now in it. There we go, a little bit of that, 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 and that, just all the way across my friends, all the way across, and there we go, that's looking good. Let's go and do the exact same for this area down here, once this is done, we'll move on to another roof. Now, uh, this, uh, unfortunately, I haven't got a lot of time to record this episode, my friends, so this might be the only thing I do in today's episode, but hopefully, you guys can learn a thing or two as I go along here, because, uh, you know, building episodes... You know, building on camera is not something I do very often, so I'm hoping that you guys will be able to take something, at least something, away from it, you know? So, uh, yeah. Alright, so let's get this in, like this, and all we've got to do is do the same over this side. So, let's do this, let's do this, and let's continue on with this thing. I was thinking maybe what we could do is add a second story to some of these houses, because some of the roofs are actually really, really tall. And I think they could do with a second story. You know? I don't know. Maybe that's just me. But let's just have a look at it now. Yeah, as you can see, it's it's made it really nice, hasn't it? It's given it a little bit more depth, a little bit more character, and it's looking really, really cool. Let's have a look at it now. Yeah, look at that. That's a massive improvement in my opinion. That's looking really cool. Okay, let's go ahead and get the rest of the stone here. Convert this all into stone brick stairs as well. And we'll do the exact same over this side. So, did a bit of this, this, this. And then we've got to do the same here. Uh, huh. Okay, can I like, can I like make this? Nope. All right, I'm going to have to build my way up to it then. There we go. Fantastic. All right, and again, let's have a look at it now from, uh, from, uh, from just back here or something. Yeah, that's already a massive improvement on this house, isn't it, my friends? This is the kind of thing I feel Mojang should implement into the game. Like, more interesting structures. Like, I don't even think, like, I know they went ahead and recently added, or somewhat recently added, the, the, what is it called, the woodland mansions? But even those, I don't think 
of that great of structures. Like, they're very cut and paste, very repetitive. Like, there's nothing that interesting to them. Like, I don't know if you guys have ever seen Green's video where he went ahead and converted a woodland mansion into, like, a big mansion. But that's the sort of structure they need to have. It's it's really quite amazing. But, you know, this may, I don't know. Maybe they should hire some Minecraft builders and Mojang to make things more interesting. But, anyways, I digress. Let's go to sleep real quick, actually. I've still got a bed inside this place. Oh boy, I should be using my bed in my house, huh? I should probably get rid of this bed, actually, and, like, go somewhere else. Alright, so yeah, that's one roof done. We've got this big flat roof over here as well, and I feel like we should be able to do something cool with this. This is, of course, the, uh, the villager blacksmith enchanting place, and I'm feeling like what could potentially go down here is maybe a bit of a... I don't know. I was thinking, like, some sort of droopy roof, so... I don't know. This is just me thinking aloud or something. Let's have a look. So let's do that. And then we'll head around here. We'll try and do the same thing. Or same kind of thing. Okay, so droops down a little bit. Uh, we've got to go up here real quick. Ha! I can't even can't even get up there. Oh man, I wish I had creative flying. <laughs> that would be cool. Alright, so a little bit of this. Droop down. Yeah, that's looking kind of decent. Even just doing that, even just doing that has made it a little bit more interesting, hasn't it? Again, it's kind of nice. So we've got the droop around this side. Let's go and do the droop around this side as well. So that's like a dance move, doesn't it? Everybody do the droop. No, I'm additive movie references. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, Tomska. I don't mean to copy. All right, um, boom. Uh, let's try and get this one in. Can I, can I? There we go. All right, and like that. Is that how it went on the other side? I think it was, right? Let's have a look. Make sure I've got it all perfectly symmetrical. Uh, yeah, okay, that's done it. So, ah, we have a problem now. We've only got a limited amount of stone slabs. But, oh uh, man, maybe we could introduce a different kind of block into this pallet. Maybe we, we use a little bit of cobblestone slabs? What do you guys think? Should we give them a go? Uh, something like this. And then uh, as we go along, we like give it a little bit more height each time. As you can see, that one's already done. So that's totally fine. Let's go ahead and put that in there. And then these three will be double tall like this. Okay. And then this will go like that. That'll go like that. Another corner here. So another double tall corner. Okay. So you get the general gist of what I'm doing here, hopefully, my friends. We're just trying to add a little bit of detail to these roofs just to make them seem a little bit more interesting because that's what I feel like this village is lacking, really. A bit of interest in the build, you know? So, again, let's just have a look at it from the bottom, see how it's looking. Uh, yeah. It's not looking too bad, is it? It is not looking too bad. Hmm. The only thing I'm thinking of now is maybe, like, doing this just to sort of smooth out the roof a little bit. What do you guys think? Is that a good idea? Maybe smoothing out the roof like this? Eh, no, maybe it gives a little bit more character. I don't know. I don't know. Let's have a look. So let's do this side as well. So like this and one there and that should... And I like... What do you, what do you guys reckon? Parkour? <gasps> there we go. Yes! Nah! Oh, I'm good at parkour. Not really. Alright, so... Yeah! Yeah, okay. Looking decent. Looking decent. All right, so all we've got to do now is get back up top here and uh, get on with the rest of this roof right here, huh? Or, may hmm. or maybe better still, what we could do is, like, introduce again a, uh, a sort of top floor, a second story, because this is very, very flat. I think it's going to take a lot of resources to go ahead and make this into a proper style roof. So, I don't know, maybe we do a little bit of that. So, something like this. We're going to need more cobblestone, huh? All right, yeah, we've got a very limited amount of resources here, folks. All right. And once again, we're just going ahead, adding a little bit of depth to this thing. So something like this. Okay. Looking decent. Looking decent. Okay. So if we were to make a second story, I was thinking... Hmm. Could we potentially put, like, a little window here, you reckon? What do you guys think? Maybe a little window? I don't know. I don't know. Maybe we need to head down to the storage area and get ourselves some uh, some glass panes out real quick. We'll give that we'll give that theory a go. See if it goes well. If so, then we'll stick with it. If not, then uh, we'll obviously have to go ahead and uh, amend it just a little bit. So yeah, let me get some resources ready, folks. All right, guys. So I'm just finishing up this roof right here, and hopefully it'll look good. So here we go. Let's get that one in there. And I think. Hold on a minute. I think that might just about be it. I think maybe. One there. Boom. Okay. 
So as you can see, we've got these little sort of poke holes throughout this place. And I think they, uh, I think that's quite nice, actually. I rather like that. It's kind of like a chain link system. Kind of gives it a sort of ye olde feel, doesn't it? Which is kind of cool. Right, now then. Just need to figure out how to get to the bottom floor, right? Oh, okay. So that's right there. So probably in here. Right, okay. So that's where that is. Hmm. Right, I'll tell you what I'm going to do real quick. Ah, there we go. So maybe we can make like a little ladder going up there. Yeah, seems like a good idea, right? So let me go ahead and uh, do exactly that. Let's get ourselves some uh, some ladders. So here we go. How many do we need? Is it just three? One, two, three. Oh, we need another one. Okay, fair enough. A uh, little bit more. And yeah, we've now converted this blacksmith house into a two-story sort of house thing. Yeah? Bad, not bad. I think we can put some things in here, some little storage areas. So, I don't know, things that I need to enchant, things that have been enchanted, all that kind of stuff. So, let's have a look at it from the outside here. Uh, yeah, that's not bad. It's not bad. The only thing I'm thinking of is I don't think I like this cobblestone sticking out here. Like, I feel like something isn't quite right with that. Hmm. <laughs> maybe what we could do is very simply replace it with spruce wood and see how that looks, maybe? But then again, this this area around here is all cobblestone, isn't it? And we've got to be careful because, of course, there's lava there. And I would rather like to keep the lava there as well. So what if I just go ahead and replace this section here, then? Uh, it's looking good already. I think that's an improvement. I honestly think that's an improvement. Let's do that. Let's do this. And then there's just a tiny section around here. And then that'll be all the cobblestone I think I want to replace. So let me go ahead and uh, make a little platform real quick. Get up here. And there we go. Okay. Not too bad. Not too bad. Let's go ahead and uh, once again have a bit of a look at it from a, from a far angle. Yeah, that's much better. I'm actually really, really liking that. I'm liking that a lot, in fact. Okay, sweet. Right, I want to go ahead and quickly introduce a little bit more in the windows department, maybe. Uh... Actually, I've just thought of an idea. To make this a little bit more symmetrical, maybe what I could do is replace this uh, bookshelf to like here or something. Yeah, I think that'll work. So let's get you in there, you in there. Let's get the glass panes out, or white glass panes, put you in there. And then of course, we've got this one here as well. But again, I think for the sake of symmetrical purposes, we can go and move this bookshelf to the right. Uh, fill that in there. Got to head outside real quick just so we can get that block back. <laughs> Alright, and then you can go in there. Yeah, not bad, not bad. And then around here, nice and symmetrical. Yeah. That's really cool. I'm actually liking that a lot. I like the fact that there's a little window up top as well. Cool. <laughs> nice one. I'm actually kind of enjoying doing this, actually. Just replacing the villager houses with something just a little bit more better. A little bit more better. That's, that's not grammatically correct, is it? <laughs> ah, not bad, not bad. Anyway, guys, let's move on to the next house. I just realised something, folks. I've been doing this entire episode without pants on. Um, that's that, that's that's not very good, is it? <laughs> oh no, my videos are gonna get age restricted now. Oh no. <laughs> Alrighty, well, it's a, you know, perfectly valid point. We do need to go and make ourselves some replacement armor real quick. In fact, no, hang on a minute. Let's have a look in here. What are we looking for? Pants and boots. Uh, what's this got? Oh, it's got Feather Falling 4. Are you kidding me? Oh, man. Can I, like, repair them? Because they got Feather Falling 4 on them, man. Uh, might be worth a look, actually. Let's have a look. So, let's go and grab ourselves out a little bit of this. There we go. And how much is it going to cost to repair? Two levels? Hey, man. I've got myself some Feather Falling 4 boots now, folks. <laughs> Nice one. And uh, there's a decent chest plate there, but uh, that one's about to run out pretty much. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, I'm going to... What's the word I'm looking for? Why did I just do that? Why did I just do that? I made an iron block. <laughs> like, I have no excuse to be doing that now, man. I mean, especially considering I've got this thing here now. Jeez, man. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Python, you are you are a dumb dumb sometimes. And the only other thing I wanted to say just before getting on with the next build is the fact that uh, I unfortunately didn't get enough time to do some AFKing, so I haven't got a name tag yet. So regarding the naming of the pig, 
then, uh, you know, you guys have got a little bit more time to send in your name suggestions. I've already seen a whole bunch of awesome ones out there, folks, but keep them coming in. It'd be awesome to see what you guys come up with. But anyways, let's move on to our next villager house to renovate. Alrighty, guys. So we actually made a little bit of a start on this house already, but we didn't actually get it finished. So I think it'll be a cool idea to get it finished. And, well, unfortunately, what that means is we're going to have to try and, you know, terraform this pathway a little bit because uh, I want the roof to come out here again just so it has a little bit more depth a little bit more character but what that also means is the fact i'm going to need to try and renovate the doorways of these two houses here because as you can see once i've got rid of this place here it, they're going to be two blocks up in the air which you know that's not the greatest thing in the world is it so let's we'll try and figure something out here folks Right, I want to go ahead and, uh, oh wait, I don't even need to do that. I just need to get rid of the uh, stone here, and then the rest of it can, like, grass over and everything will be fine, you know? So, let's go ahead and uh, fill that back in. Nope, that's the wrong block. Let's try that again. Let's fill that back in. <laughs> There we go. All right, looking good. So once again, I think we're going to go with the uh, stone brick accent design. We want to try and go with like a, a mutual design for most of the roofs or the same sort of color palette for most of the roofs because it is like a city or a little village and it kind of makes sense to have them of the same kind of material. So yeah, obviously, you know, we've already got stair blocks here, but we're going to replace them and uh, we're going to make this place look better. Okay, so don't you worry your faces. It might look strange now, but believe me, it is going to look awesome once it's done. Okay, believe me, believe me. You guys better be believing. <laughs> All right, so let's head up here real quick. Uh, so let's do that, do that, do this. There we go, and a little bit of that. And, well, actually, that's about as far as it goes, isn't it? Huh. Hmm. Exactly. Hmm. We'll see how it goes there, villager. We'll see how it goes. You might see already that I did indeed get myself a little bit more in the stone bricks department, which is cool. So, yeah, I think what I'm going to do real quick is I'm going to go and get rid of the current roof, like, almost in its entirety. And we're going to renovate it and make it look just a bit more awesome, folks. Alrighty, guys. So, check it out. I think I might just about have this, my friends. I think I might just about have it. As you can see, all I did is I tried to make the stairs all sort of meet up. And I've managed to do that successfully, which is pretty dumb done awesome so we just got to go on the inside now and just make sure it still looks reasonably like a house you know all right so let's have a bit of a look uh so here is what we are going to amend we're going to go ahead and get rid of this little ledge right here and then what we're also going to go and do is fill in this section. I definitely feel like there's more potential to this house. Like, there's a lot of room inside this house. I honestly feel like we can do some awesome things inside this. Again, maybe adding in a second story or some sort of ledge. Just something to make the build a bit more interesting. You know what I'm saying? So, let's just do that. And let's fill in this section over here. Can I, can I get that? There we go. Okay, fantastic. And then we've got the stone bricks there. Right, I'm going to cover up the stone bricks because I don't really want them visible. Okay. Not bad, not bad, not bad, not bad. All right, cool. And then maybe just here we can, like, start smoothing things out with some, uh, with some stairs. You know, just to make it look a bit nicer. So, something like this. And then something like this. I think... Yeah, this should work real nicely, actually. I've got a good feeling about this design that I've got going on here. Like, maybe... Hmm, maybe I don't need to make it into a two-story house. Hmm. This, this is honestly looking kind of nice. Okay, let's maybe wrap this round here. Okay, and then somehow we've got to make this, like, connect up over here. What do you guys think? Hmm. Okay, maybe we'll make it go around that way. It should go around a U-bend or something. Yep, that's looking decent. And then maybe just to smooth off the roof just a little bit, we'll put a slab in there like that. What do you guys think? Yeah, that's looking a lot better, isn't it? That's looking kind of nice. I'm liking that. Uh, there's definitely still some improvements to be made to this place, but at the very least, the exterior is in fact done, which I'm pretty darn happy about. So let's go ahead and... Uh, oh, hello, hello. We got a customer here. A customer for the killing of the villagers. Not going to happen there, brother. Not going to happen. <laughs> All right. So, yeah, not too bad. Not too bad. We've got this thing pretty much done. Now we just got to try and amend the doorways of these two places. I think what I need to do here is maybe make this cobblestone span down a little bit. So, okay, let's go here. Oh, that's quite nice, actually. These two sort of meet up quite nicely. So maybe we put, like, the stairs here. So, oak stairs, boom, boom, boom. And then the pathway will continue on this level. And then, of course, like I was mentioning, we'll put the cobblestone sort of supports for the house down like this. Okay. And then maybe what we do is put the doorway down here. 
and then maybe we could just like put some stairs inside the place. Oh, 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 no, 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 no. Oh, please don't be the mending villager. Wait, was it a mending villager? Where did he go? Oh, jeez, I legitimately don't know where he went. You don't, are you in here? Bother? Oh, no. I don't know where he is. I don't know. I've made a catastrophic mistake here, folks. I don't know where he went. Legit. Oh, jeez. Is he in here? Mr. Villager? He went somewhere, but I don't know where he went, mate. Oh, crap. No. What have I done? I don't know where he went. Oh, no. Okay. Um, This is like kind of an emergency. We need to find that villager. He had an epic trade on him. Right, we're gonna, I think we need to sleep. I think that's going to be our first portal. Wait, hang on a minute. Maybe if I follow the zombie. What do you guys think? If I follow the zombie, maybe it'll reveal him. I don't know about that. I don't know about that. Right, we need to we need to sleep, like, right now. <laughs> get rid of this rain. Get rid of the night time. And we've got to find that blooming villager before he dies real quick. Come on, man. Come on. There we go, folks. I've amended the doorway here. We've got a little bit of a staircase in there. And, yeah, unfortunately, I still haven't managed to find that white-robed villager. Where the devil did he go? Like, I heard doors going, but I couldn't find him. That's so strange. I don't know where he is, man. Was there a villager in here? No, there wasn't. Okay, so I can actually amend this one just, you know, as per the norm. So that is totally fine. So let's get that one going right here. Let's just uh, amend the floor a little bit here. Okay. All right, that'll do. And then maybe we can just, like, replace this like that and then just put dirt here. This is to signify that this is where a door's going. So, yeah. Okay, so we've got the we've got the pathway amended, we've got the doorways amended as well. We've got little uh, windows here, which is a little bit strange. Maybe we can go and amend this a little bit. We've got one glass pane, a singular glass pane to do this with. All right, and then put that there, put this there, and as you can see, it kind of matches up with the style of the windows around here. In that these are double tall, and then we've got these two. Well, there's a window to the side here as well, which we could probably do a sorting out at some point. But uh, not bad. We've definitely not done too bad here, folks. Alrighty guys, but anyways, on that note, it is going to be time to end this episode. Like I said, I do apologize for the slightly more rushed style of the episode, perhaps. Uh, but it's not very often I get to do, like, building episodes on camera with you guys. So if you do like this kind of stuff, if you learned something today, or you want to see more sort of building on camera episodes, let me know with a like rating or drop a comment. Of course, feedback on any of these builds is also very much appreciated. I will, of course, be doing all of the rest of the villager buildings in a future episode, perhaps. But uh, for now, my friends, it is time to end. Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed the episode be sure to drop a like rating hit that subscribe button if you don't want to miss out on future content but for now it is time for me to head off thank you so much for watching folks and i'll see you guys in the next episode